Hello friends, welcome to Vitish Academy. Today in this presentation, we are going to solve an example on binomial theorem. So we have to prove that c0 plus c1 into c1 plus c2 into c2 plus c3 so on cn minus 1 plus cn is equal to n plus 1 whole power n divided by n factorial into c0 into c1 into c2 so on cn. So first let us consider the LHS. So here let us take c0 as a common factor. We get here c0 into 1 plus c1 divided by c0 and by taking c1 as a common factor we get c1 into 1 plus c2 divided by c1 and here let us take c2 as a common factor we get 1 plus c3 divided by c2 so on coming to the nth term of the expansion let us take cn minus 1 as a common factor we get here cn minus 1 into 1 plus cn divided by cn minus 1 and now let us group all these terms we get c0 into c1 into c2 so on cn minus 1 into 1 plus nc1 divided by nc0 into 1 plus nc2 divided by nc1 into 1 plus nc3 divided by nc2 so on the nth term that is 1 plus ncn divided by ncn minus 1. So let us recall the formula of ncr divided by ncr minus 1 is equal to n minus r plus 1 divided by r. So by applying this formula let us find the value of nc1 divided by nc0. So here we get the r value as 1. So on substituting we get n minus 1 plus 1 divided by 1. So we can cancel over here minus 1 and plus 1 and the value for n divided by 1 would come as n. And similarly let us find the value for nc2 divided by nc1. So here we get the r value as 2. On substituting we get n minus 2 plus 1 divided by 2. That implies we get n minus 1 divided by 2. So the value of nc3 divided by nc2 would be n minus 3 plus 1 divided by 3. So this would come as n minus 2 divided by 3. Now let us find the value of the nth term that is ncn divided by ncn minus 1. So by comparing we get the value of r as n. Now let us substitute in the formula we get n minus n plus 1 divided by n. So here we can cancel over plus n and minus n in the numerator and we get here 1 by n. Now let us replace all these values in this expression. We get here c0 into c1 into c2 so on cn minus 1 into 1 plus n into 1 plus n minus 1 divided by 2 into 1 plus n minus 2 divided by 3 into so on 1 plus 1 by n. So this would come as c0 into c1 into c2 so on cn minus 1 into 1 plus n and here by taking 2 as the LCM we get 2 plus n minus 1 divided by 2 and here by taking 3 as the LCM we get 3 plus n minus 2 divided by 3 so on by taking here n as the LCM we get n plus 1 divided by n so we can write this as c0 into c1 into c2 so on cn minus 1 into 1 plus n into n plus 1 divided by 2 into n plus 1 divided by 3 plus so on n plus 1 divided by n. So therefore this would come as c0 into c1 into c2 so on cn minus 1 and here we observe that the remaining terms are the expansion of n plus 1 divided by n factorial whole power n. So this is nothing but the required RHs. So this was a basic introduction on how to solve an example on binomial theorem. Hope you understood the concept. Refer to more videos on our website vtshacademy.com. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.